we've got the Philadelphia 76ers playing against the Boston Celtics here in Boston. I'm Brian Anderson. With me tonight, Grant Hill and Richard Jefferson with Allie LaForce joining us courtside. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Joel Embiid is out there with Caleb Martin. Then there's Tyrese Maxey. Then there's Kelly Oubre. And it's George in at the three, the small forward. And for Boston, White and Brown are the two of the three. Kristaps Porzingis out there with Jason Tatum. And it's Holiday in at the one spot. Well, looking at this Eastern Conference showdown here, Grant. Two juggernauts going at it tonight. Should be a good one. It will be a good one, B.A. And you can feel the energy, the electricity in here right now. Now, both of these teams really want to win this one because it's a matter of pride for both. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. And here's Tatum. Beyond the arc. Joel Embiid with the board. Now here's George. Now Maxi. Outside Oubre. Let's it fly. And he knocks the Oubre jumper down. Jr. Heads up Assisted. on the money pass by Maxi. Great Maxi. Here's White. Pass to Tatum. to white six to shoot count it one for yeah. one to start one. the game just taking it right to the rim and no one was there to greet him easy possessions like that literally are just a gift you just dream of them you'll gladly take those now here's maxi pass to martin it's stolen by tatum holiday against maxi Brown with it. Now here's Porzingis. This one for three. Always a nice way to start. Porzingis. Makes his first one. Proven he's more than just a go-to score. Brown also loves swinging the ball to open teammates. Embiid against Porzingis. George for three. Rebounded by the Celtics. Here's Brown, and the shot is good on the assist by Tatum. Oh, he can do a lot with the ball, but Brown is just as good playing off the ball. He's always ready to catch and fire. Outside Maxi. They need this. Nails it from three. Tyrese Maxi. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Here's White. to Holiday. Oh, a clear Philadelphia foul there foul. on the missed shot. Kelly so he'll Oubre get a pair at the line. Kelly Oubre first, picks one up. Foul. A physical guard who plays foul. with no fear. Holiday doesn't at get the to line. the line as often as you Dream think. Holiday. from falls for him. Lots of winning going on in Philadelphia. Six straight playoff appearances, Richard. Yeah, they're the masters of the mid. Their game, that's just the way it is. No finals appearances. And look, that's got to be top of mind. East is tough, but they've got the talent to go far, but they just keep having mid seasons. Holiday hits them both. And talk about consistency, RJ. Boston has made the Eastern Conference Finals five out of the last seven years. Yeah, that's pretty phenomenal, especially since some of their best players are still developing. I know a guy that thinks that they haven't been very good for a very long time, but I know what Celtics fans want. They want a ring, but they should still feel very proud of what this young team has accomplished. Now here's Tatum. 4-3. It's hauled in by Oubre. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Tatum. Sixers ball. Holiday against Maxi. at six. 
Crosby, over the course of his career, we've seen Holiday's defense change games. I mean, that's how good he is at that end. Tatum with it. Back to Holiday. Driving inside. Can't cash it in from close range. Philadelphia has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Embiid passes to Maxi. From seven. And there's the whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And Joel Embiid is a rarity in many ways, including how effective he is inside, Richard. Yeah, B.A., we don't see that as much as he used to. Big man Joel dominating Embiid. down low, but in is an exception. A center with a deadly mix of dominance down low and skill work outside. He's off on the first. Shooting over 80% from the line during his career. Embiid is not only one of the best free throw shooting centers in the league today, he's one of the best all time. He's good on the second. And this summer, the Sixers making changes on the bench. Grant, the mission statement is clear. Make it past the conference semifinals. Oh, so clear, B.A. And while that's been the stumbling block in recent years, I'm not sure even that's good enough. This is a team with legitimate championship aspirations. Maxi passes to Oubre. George outside. Pass to Martin. Fires the three. Holiday grabs the miss. The Celtics have gone four of seven, shooting a solid percentage. Tatum finds Holiday. Back to Tatum. Let's the three fly. Buries it from three. What is he doing? Got to get out to Tatum. He is too good of an outside shooter to be given that much airspace. Now here's Ubre. Pass to Maxi. The rebound, Celtics. That's a decent look for him. He just couldn't convert. Holiday. And Holiday powers it home. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. They came out and won a huge difference in activity level from both teams tonight. And Philadelphia calls time here. And even in a short time in the NBA, Tatum has become the model oh, wing for the modern yeah. NBA arcade. Yeah, he does everything. So well. Shooting, defense, playmaking, you name it, this man has it. He gives you everything you want and need in that wing position. on the shot clock not gonna go that time some solid defense from Martin her ball 
lost, and they've got six of ten attempts to fall. Outside Holiday. Pass to Porzingis. Outside Holiday. Shoots over Embiid. And Embiid with the block. Yeah, defensively, Embiid can take over a game with his reach. Big loss And a foul Gibson called on the way up. So he'll take first, two from the free throw line. Well, Boston's been a franchase ball. that has sustained winning, Richard. Should be for Philadelphia. Had down years Taylor, like Eddie, Martin, but they don't have two down shots. decades. And the Celtics, they replenish as fast as any team outside of maybe their rival Lakers. That free throw misses. And where the Sixers really separate themselves, Richard, elite in both three-point and free throw percentage. Yeah, with Embiid doing what he does, you're going to get a lot of free throws. And you're going to get looks from range because of the amount of attention that he gets. And he sinks the second. Austin on offense. They're on a 16-5 run. Tatum inside. George defending. And finished off by Tatum. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really setting the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. Now here's Oubre. Back to Maxi. The three. Jalen Brown with a rebound. And so Brown will bring it up to the Boston Celtics. They lead by 11. And the basket by Holiday. Yeah, good execution and close. Holiday likes mixing things up and finishing from this area. Here's Maxi. Pass to Martin. Outside Oubre. Here's the three. Sends it home from three-point land. Oubre's got five. This is why you always have to chase guys off the arc because everyone has a three-point shot now. Here's Holiday, and the Six foul is called. Foul. He missed it, Joel so he's got a couple of free throws coming First, this way. Personal the one foul. thing you got to love about Second Drew Holiday foul. is he's a true two-way player in this Line. league. He puts in a Drew lot Holiday. of work to make a big impact on both sides of the floor. And he makes a first. Some changes for Boston. Al Horford's checked in for Kristaps Porzingis. And it's Hauser in for White. Covington's checked in for Philadelphia. Gordon comes in for Oubre. He's off on the second. And the 76ers shooting an unremarkable 30% of the first. For three, Covington. Kept alive. Horford with some nice D. For Boston, they've got 8 of 13 attempts to go. Here's Hauser. And he hits the jump Damn. shot. Hauser. And the Celtics lead by 13. Yeah, the savvy of Horford on display. Just tremendous pass. Oh, oh, oh. And Philadelphia yeah. calls time here. And as the coaches draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's key to keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up.
George. Now Covington. From 13. It's rebounded by Jalen Brown. More often than not, he'll cash it in from that area. The defense might have done just enough to bother him. And here's Holiday. Tatum from long range. Joel Embiid with the board. Embiid's got four rebounds in the game. Pass to Maxi. George with it. The three is up. Austin with a rebound. Tatum's got four rebounds now. Takes the three. With the putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the Celtics lead by 15. The value of a big man with Horford's quickness can't be overstated. He takes full advantage of the rebound opportunity. Maxi against Holiday. Ooh, rejected by Horford. Brown. Richard, we saw a new look for Jalen Brown in 2023. An injury forced him to shot a mask. Yeah, face mask. Third team infamous right now. Some guys struggle with them. Some guys were just fine. Like, didn't seem to bother Brown that much. I will give him that. Can't get the first one. Brown now an elite scorer in this league. Really does it all. And the second free throw is good. Now Maxi. The three. He drops it from Reese. Maxi. Maxi's got six. From three point land. Few guys in this league are better than Maxi. You have to run him off that line. Here's Holiday. He can't hit that time. Embiid with a nice defensive effort. Here's Covington. It's George on the wing. Another three oh, for Philadelphia. George. They're capable of shooting 40% from deep for a season. Paul George is steady from downtown. The drive by Holiday. Rebound by the 76ers. And he's usually able to score on that type of defense rather easily. Surprising to see him come away empty. Embiid gets the bucket. Just so nimble for his size. Embiid able to still knock down the shot. Time Just out, time out. Boston, time out. And Boston calls time here. Always ahead of steam, Richard. Tyrese Maxey is so electric. You never know what he's going to bring. Here we go, man. Time to, to make some noise for Boston's own. Something. Richard Tatum definitely uses that to his advantage. Subbed in for Holiday. Horford passes to Tatum. Over Covington. Boston again missing. He was so well positioned to interfere with the shot. Textbook defense. Take a good angle to the shooter. Two and minutes remaining the in piece. the first. Two minutes. And it's Jason Tatum with a rebound. Tatum's got a rebound number five here tonight. Pass to Pritchard. Lowry with a rebound. 
the steal. Fast break, Philadelphia. Three-pointer. And they recover it. Out to Covington from outside the arc. Sinks it from Robert distance. Covington. Yeah, well, Covington was totally prepared there. He had the shot all picked out and just needed to be fed. Here's Tatum. He's got five. And it's blocked by Embiid. One ten left to play in the first. Out to Gordon. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. 59 seconds left in the first. Pass to Mikhailuk. Here's Hauser. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Horford. And too long on the shot. And the defense was all over him once he got in close. Didn't want him to get too comfortable. Gabaselli. The rebound. Celtics. Oh, stolen by Embiid. From behind the arc. Rebounded by the Celtics. Tatum's got six rebounds in the game. They still need this. And Horford gets it to go. Horford's got his second bucket of the game. Well, Horford isn't afraid to go old school and drop a shot there from mid-range. MB, good. He's a producer. It's part of their plan to get him as many touches as possible. No good there. Well, good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. Celtics out in front. They lead by three. One year. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. 25. as we get back to a game that's been pretty close so far here. And for the Celtics here, guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? Give it up for their D. They're battling, communicating, and coming up with key stops. It's been a group effort, and that's what it takes to play the kind of defense that they've played. Great showing from them. And here's Lowry. He'll bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. It's a three-point game. Horford at the four with Porzingis at the five. Fiatosov Mikhailuk is out there with Peyton Pritchard. Hey, uh, and it's Hauser in at the small forward position. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Here's Pritchard. Yet to see a basket. All right, RJ, let me put you on the spot. In the not-so-distant future, let's say 2028, who's the face of the NBA? Who wants to see a Hauser? still be playing, but my smart money is on Luka. He's already a superstar. Or maybe it's Victor Rabinyama. He's 7-4. We've never seen a guy that can do what he does at his size, but I can't wait to find and out. Man, that one drops for him. The Celtics shooting the ball at 48% so far. And about a minute gone in the second quarter. Here's Pritchard. Count it. Hey, that's what speed and agility will do for you. Big time play. The Sixers trailing. Lowry, the pass to Gordon. Embiid inside. Working on Porzingis. And the officials call goaltending. So they'll award the basket. Well, at least the D was going for it. On the court. To the ball just a moment late. White, he's checked in for Mikhailu. Paul George, he's checked in for the Sixers. Maxi comes in for Lowry. Second quarter of action, about a minute and a half play. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. The Celtics are battle-tested, and ask what comes from that experience. Jalen Brown said, quote, voice. Being able to see and read the game. Our offense has been able to take leaps by understanding the game and what they want to take away and just letting the game decide. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's been the key. Thanks, Allie. Now here's Embiid. He has seven. Austin, yeah, don't make it happen. Of this. We've seen well, games where Embiid shoots two free throws in the ball. ball. He is so First good getting ball. himself to the line. At the line for the 76ers, Joel Embiid taking two shots.
first one falls. Brown, he's checked in for Boston. Holiday comes in for Pritchard. And Embiid drops them both. Boston's gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Holiday against Toubre. Wow! Gutsy finish inside by Brown. Running it all day. Jalen Brown, this man competes. And teammates, they take notice of things like that. Pass to Martin. Goes up on the wing. Another miss. He's one for four from the field. Austin's gone two for two from the arc here in the second. And they get it back. White can't hit. Philadelphia's got six out of 15 three so far in this game. And the whistle on the shot. Get some contact there. This is the shot, but he'll shoot two. Seventeen of Embiid. At his size, he is just a the Philadelphia. challenge to guard Joel the drive Embiid. without foul. Taking two shots. Good. Some changes for Boston. Cornette's checked in for Hauser, and Pritchard is subbed in for Holiday. And Embiid drops them both. It's always nice to see a big fella be able to knock down some free throws and make teams pay for the line. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. Puts up a three. Paul George pulls down the board. And so it's George with it. He brings it up for Philadelphia. Trailing by two. And here's Oubre from the arc. Second shot opportunity. Porzingis with the block. Great play by Porzingis. Love seeing the zinger engaged on deep. Pritchard, the pass to White. Oh, here's White on the drive. Zen is draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That's on Joel Embiid. Well, if we want to talk about Derek White for a moment. He's become such an effective defender for two. Yeah, you know, B.A., he's got a great mix of awareness and ability. Just an exceptional quickness that allows him to be a disruptor at that end. That's good from White. You know, when Derek White came into the league, he ran the point. Richard, things have changed since then. Yeah, B.A., since transitioning into more of a scoring role as a guard, White has not disappointed, taking more shots and seeing those scoring averages go up. Andre Drummond has checked in for the Sixers. Jackson comes in for Maxi. And so he's able to get one of two. And out of bounds, Boston, Boston will have it. Boston ball. The Celtics with the lead. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. He shoots. And there's Oubre. That one's good. Oubre. On the assist by Jackson. Oubre's got seven. And it's Jackson's responsibility to find his open teammates in a terrific dime there. White, the pass to Pritchard. Side, Brown. There's the three. Again, the miss by the Celtics. The 76ers have gone four for seven in the second quarter. Drummond finds Jackson. Outside Oubre. Here's Martin. And Porzingis with the block. 
Here's Pritchard, defended by Jackson. Forcing his high post. He's against Martin. Offensive rebound. White for three. Doesn't go for him. Philadelphia has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. Pass to Jackson. Porzingis against George. Gets it to go. Oh, Makes him two for Lord. five. Yeah, tough bucket for George. He's just so good at maintaining his focus. Here's Pritchard. He's got five. White for three. Three-pointer goes up. Three-pointer goes down for White. And that's on the defense, giving him a decent look. That's his shot. And Philadelphia calls time here. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. Yeah, this is a good opportunity to get your group together and make sure everyone is on the same page. So it's George with it. He brings it up for Philadelphia. Trailing by two. Shot from 12. And the 76ers oh, tack on two more. There's the athleticism from George. Getting loose out there. White the pass to Porzingis. Outside, Brown. Pass to Pritchard. From the arc. Good. And Brown gets the assist. Brown's got three assists in the game. Ooh, can't ask for a cleaner look than that, and he'll make you pay. Now here's Drummond. Back to George. For three. Porzingis grabs the board. Austin's gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. Cornet. And that one is stuffed right through. The unique perspective of a big. Porzingis has great awareness and the ability to easily find the open man. Jackson outside. Pass to George. Let's go with a three. Connects from downtown. Oh, George. George has got three. seven points for the quarter. You can't lose a shooter like him on the court. The ball will find its way to him, and he will drill a three each time. Now here's White. He's got six. To the paint. It's stolen by Drummond. Outside Oubre. Let's it go. Porzingis grabs the board. Porzingis has got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Brown. Hey, Jalen Brown strikes it through. There's that leaping going down. He just gets up so easy. Here's George. Count that bucket. Oh, George. George has got 12. Nice move to get inside and create a good look for himself. Here's White. Inside. Cornette in the post. Drummond defending. Baseline try. Drummond grabs the miss. The 76ers have gotten 8 of 14 shots to drop so far in the second. Here's Martin. And Porzingis with the block. Here's Cornette. Drummond defending. Oh, and he got Six fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. <laughs> no debate there. He got hammered. 
second team. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Celtics. The ball movement has been outstanding so far. They've come out of the gate looking for that extra pass. Yeah, I also like how they've immediately gotten out in transition. They came to run, and we'll see if they can keep it up. First free throw is good. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for Boston. Embiid, he's checked in for the Sixers. Tyrese Maxey comes in for Jackson. So he hits both. The Sixers trailing. George with it. He's got 12. Oh, and there's Boston the whistle ball. on the shot. So two Barrett free throws Green. for him coming up. Second person is all over his career. Third Paul George ball. has racked up more than his fair share of actually. Well, he's a fixture Paul at All Star George. Weekend, that's for sure. Now, Belong he's made the all defensive team more than few times he's had an outstanding career and he drops the first and you got to give Paul George credit for his mental toughness there's always lots of chatter out there but he tunes it out and just focuses on his game Hits them both. Productive trip to the line. Celtics. He doesn't like to leave points on the table. Now a timeout called by Boston. Celtics entertainment, everyone. Come on, make some noise. Give a big round of applause for Celtics entertainment. Here's Holiday. Nine points in the game. to Tatum. Here's Mikhailuk. Shoots. It's hauled in by Oubre. There's no way that's the best look this offense can produce. And you couldn't get a better shot off? Like, come on, you gotta make the extra pass. Like, being a teammate will go so far in this league. The great positioning, the 7-1 wingspan, that combination makes Horford a dangerous shot blocker. Here's Tatum. Oh, just couldn't take the lid off. They had their chances. Came up empty. Outside Maxi. From deep. Sinks the tray. Tyrese. Maxi's got nine points. Austin trailing. Pass to Mikhailuk. And here's Tatum. He's got five. Here's Hauser. He can't get that one to fall. Good work defensively by Oubre. Now George. Maxi with it. He's covered by Holiday. Ooh, and he took Second a hard foul. foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Second Inside deep, basically ball. taking away their good options. The long for the 76ers. Yeah, look here at the scoring breakdown for the 76ers. Maxie. Well, so far, their long range shooting has been the story, doing damage from deep. You also can't ignore that they're winning the effort battle, grabbing offensive rebounds and making the most of those extra possessions. The first free throw is good. The thing you love about Maxi is that he always has a smile when he's out there. He's enjoying himself, and he embraces the challenge that the game presents. Both free throws good from Maxi. Boston has gone 6 of 14 from the perimeter tonight. Holiday surveying the floor. Pass to Mikhailuk. 
and he banks in the layup. And Holiday going up ladder. Holiday serving it up for his teammate. Philadelphia has gone three of six from outside in the second quarter. And here's Embiid. Back to Maxi. Outside Covington. Launches a three. Bowser grabs the board. Austin's gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. And Tatum fires one home. <laughs> Just a merciless night where the bird means dunk by Tatum. Reminding the defense that Kel, you cannot stop him. And from the sideline, let's catch up with Allie. Well, Jalen Brown has shown steady Maxi. development over his career. He said, quote, every year presents different challenges. I think that's the fun part about basketball, that it's not the same. You gotta be flexible, you gotta be durable, and you have to be able to grow with the game, Brian. Allie, he keeps getting better and better. Thanks for that, good stuff. Embiid against Holiday. Boston with a rebound. That's going up against a defense that knows your tendencies. Tatum. And finished off by Tatum. Already seven lead changes. These teams are really going after each other. It's been a brutal game to play, but a fun one to watch. Now here's Maxi. 13 points in the game. Fast break. Here we go. Ooh, rocket finish from Tatum. Rushing off the contact look. The dude is strong. When he gets in there, it's easy. That's an easy bucket. Holiday against Maxi. To the left side wing. Gabaselli. The Sixers with another miss. And Tatum's got the ball here for the Boston Celtics. Three-point lead. An average score whenever Tatum Robert forces Covington. the issue and goes at the First defense, they have foul. to compromise. Third team foul. At the line, Jason Tatum. Falls for Tatum. Now, multi talented swingman Tatum just continues to get better and better each year. And so Tatum nails both of them. The Sixers trailing. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. That's a very avoidable turnover. you got to focus on the details. Here's Holiday. Nine points in the game. Pass to Horford. Over Embiid. Back to Holiday. From deep three-point land. Oh, and the release was before the buzzer. But it's off target. The first half comes to a conclusion in a game that's been very close so far. Celtics out in front. They lead by five. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. I'm here with Nick Nurse. And, Coach, I saw you imploring your team to pick it up. Where do you need to be better in the second half? Well, we're not very good uh, offensively right now. I think we're taking some okay shots, but we got to be a little bit more patient and keep moving it around a little bit. We need multiple paint touches rather than just one. So we just got to do a little bit better job of getting off it and relocating a little bit. Patience is a virtue. Thank you, Coach. All right, Allie, thanks for that. We will see everyone right back after this break, ready for the second half. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. We welcome you back. Ernie Johnson with Shaquille O'Neal. Kenny the Jet Smith. Quite the tussle there in the first half, huh? Boston found themselves in a close game in the first. 
the period came to a close with them holding a three-point lead. Looking at the Celtics, Kenny, how'd you feel about it? It's been an aggressive approach for them at the offensive end. Getting the ball inside and getting as many points as possible close to the rim. So far, so good. They have a nice edge in the points in the paint. Shaq, what'd you think about Philadelphia? Defensively, they got to do a better job of staying connected. They're getting good up from beyond the line. Better to crowd those guys, force them to put the ball on the floor and make it play. That about wraps it up. Time now for the second half of the game. We go to Kevin Harlan for the call. Fans, please give a big round of applause for your Celtics youth dead team. We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Paul George has been sensational. They've leaned on him to provide a lot of offense, and that's how he likes it. He always wants to be a go-to guy for them. I'm sure he'll be calling for the ball even more in this half. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Taking a look at Philadelphia. Tyrese Maxey is out there with Kelly Oubre. Then there's Caleb Martin. Then there's Paul George. And it's Embiid in it. Five down low. And so it's Boston with it. At one point, they led by 16. Brown passes to Porzingis. Oh, stolen by Embiid. Left side, Maxi to the inside. Pass to George. Back to Martin. Now here's George. Five on the clock. Out to Ubre. There's the triple. The rebound, Celtics. Porzingis has got rebound number five here tonight. Brown passes to Holiday. Oh, what a finish in traffic! My goodness! I mean, you watch Holiday play this game. He just explodes off the screens. Very good in pick and roll. Pass to George. Jacks up a three. The rebound, Celtics. Tatum's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's Brown. Look at Brown. Getting it done inside. Impressive ball oh, and play from Tatum. Attracts the other team's focus and then finds the open man. Maxi passes to Oubre. And that was good. Oubre's got nine points. Assist good heads-up basketball. Tyrese Season Maxie. opening, it capitalizes. Pass to Tatum. Back to Brown. Outside, Porzingis. Here's Tatum. Porzingis finds Tatum. Tatum! Jason. Works through the defense inside. Nifty moves for Tatum, so crafty with the rock. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Here's Maxi. Pass to Oubre. And he drops in the layup Billy off the glass. Oubre, Jr. 11 points in the game. A quality pass, setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Holiday with the ball. Picked up by Embiid. White for three. Here's Porzingis. Okay, do it, KP. Porzingis. And a authoritative play by Porzingis. Dominating the glass and getting the second chance look. Pass to Martin. Back to George. Three-pointer. Nails it from oh, beyond the arc. George. You give a shooter a his caliber that much time to seam it up? Oh, yeah, you're done. Holiday passes to Tatum. Outside White. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. You can get away with one once in a while, but it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. 
you got to blow the whistle when it's that obvious. Great call there by the official. A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Oubre against White on the attack. Oubre. You look at how they've come out in the second half. It's almost like night and day. And they look like a completely different team. I wonder what Coach said to them at halftime to help spark this momentum change. The kick to Tatum. And here's Brown for three. The rebound by Maxi. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that open. Shoots over White. The offensive rebound. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot it there. Yeah, he just terrorizes the defenses on the inside. First team foul. Guarding the big fella. At the line for the 76ers, Joel Embiid. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Drops them both. Boston has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. And the Celtics call time here. Things just aren't going their way. He clearly wants to talk it over. Good timeout if you ask me. They have the momentum. They to find a way to try and stop it. from the arc and score it. That now Oubre makes him 7 for 11 in this game. All right, well, a look at how the hustle game has been going for the 76ers. They've been defending with excellent anticipation all game long. Just look at how many times they've managed to get their hands on the ball. Yeah, another thing they did well defensively, closing out. Inside and outside, their defenders were flying out to shooters. Now here's Maxi. 13 points in the game. Outside Oubre. No good with the triple. And it's Tatum with the ball for the Celtics. At one point, they led by 16. Left side, Holiday. Pass to Porzingis. Porzingis punishing inside. Porzingis. Check out Porzingis' energy. He's just relentless on both ends of the court. Maxi passes to Martin. Three, George. Holiday grabs the miss. Holiday's got four rebounds now. Pass to Tatum. Brown against Maxi. Brown passes to White. And Embiid with the block. In transition. 
position. Here they come. For three, Maxi. It's hauled in by White. White's got his fourth rebound in this one. Brown finds Holiday. Good. And Brown gets the assist. Brown's got four assists in the game. Terrific night for Holiday so far. And I have to pin it on his energy. He's given this game all he's got. Timeout called. The 76ers. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. All right, I'm sure coach is going to give them an earful about that. They can't be happy with that soft interior. And some changes here for the 76ers. Covington comes in for Martin. And it's Gordon in for Oubre. George passes to Maxi. Outside Covington. Will it go? They get it back. And they're going to awesome count that foul. bucket. And they'll send Jared him to the line. It could be Jared a three-point play. Foul. The reach of Embiid with Shooting his size and Philadelphia. wingspan. He's Joel a real threat Embiid. on the offensive glass. The line for one. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Celtics. Look, they're getting good looks inside. It's been a point of emphasis all night long, but I love this hard-nosed attitude of this team. Yeah, another thing you notice are all the assists. The ball just has energy, and everyone is getting involved. The Celtics have gotten seven of their first 11 attempts to go in this half. Now here's Brown. Nine points in the game. Pass to Porzingis. Shoots over Embiid. Porzingis misses. The 76ers have gotten six of 14 shots to drop in this third quarter. George passes to Embiid. And they'll get another chance. Now Tatum. He's got 15. And the officials Boston will call the illegal screen here. And that is an absolute awful breaker of a turnover. And a close game like this, that Celtics. might be enough to impact the And some changes here for the Celtics. Horford comes in for Kristaps Porzingis. And it's Hauser in for White. Maxi on the wing. He's covered by Holiday. Pass to Gordon. It's Covington on the wing. Shoots over Tatum. And he buries that one. Back rim and in. Covington's got five now. Boston's gone only one of three from deep here in the third. Holiday passes to Tatum. George with a steal. Over Tatum. George's shot is off. The Celtics with the lead. Here's Brown. Nine points in the game. Oh, stolen by Embiid. Pass to Maxi. Back to Embiid. For the lead. Philadelphia, the rebound. And that one's good. Robert Covington. Covington. These teams just keep trading the lead. <laughs> yeah, you wonder what it's going to take for someone to pull away. Here's Holiday. Book it again. Ooh. Seven for 12 Holiday. and going at the defense. This is what makes Holiday special. His ability to find ways to finish in tight. Maxi surveys. And he lobs it up top with the steal to the middle here's Tatum good D by Covington showing great intensity around the rim it's part of why he's a respected defender yeah you can see why he's established that reputation strong understanding of how to defend the rim. and there's the call it's going to be an illegal screen you can get away with one once in a while but it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick you gotta blow the whistle when it's that obvious. Great call there by the official. Mikai Luke's checked in for Boston. Pritchard comes in for Brown. Outside Holiday. And he drives in. Here's Mikai Luke. Oh, and he 
Blocks it off the glass. Wow. Lowry outside. Goes back up. And it's good oh, on the land. And the 76ers lead by one. Yeah, even inside, among the bigs, Lowry can find his finish. <laughs> I mean, he's that clever offensively. Here's Mikhailu. Austin, no good that time either. And that's a low percentage shot, and I'm sure he knows it. And those are the type of shots that just drive coaches crazy. Like, I wouldn't be shocked to see him sitting on the bench and try that man. Is remaining in the third. Plenty of contact on that shot. Philadelphia Officials foul. call the foul, and he'll take two free first throws now. Personal foul, first team foul. At the line, V. Mapailu. First free throw is good. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And so Lowry will bring it up for the 76ers. They trail by one. We've got a minute 48 left in the third quarter. Let's it fly. The putback controls the rebound and the putback. Well, Embiid will do this all night if he can. Protecting the play and finishing it strong. Here's Pritchard. He's guarded by Lowry. Pritchard, the pass to Mikhailu. Boston, no good that time either. And for Philadelphia, they're shooting only 40% from the floor in this game. Here's Yabaselli. For three, Lowry! Gets the three ball to go. Lowry. And now it's a 4-point 76ers lead. They fought so hard to get themselves in a position to win this game. And it's so much easier said than done. But now it's all about keeping that momentum going for them. Here's Pritchard. Give him eight. And he'll throw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That'll belong to Kyle Lowry. First personal good foul. Whistle there. Second team foul. At the line, Peyton Pritchard. One falls for him. The Celtics making a switch here. Tatum's checked in. It's both from the strike. The Sixers leading. outside they get the rebound shot clock at six another three for Philadelphia this is what it's been since halftime remarkable results from downtown in the modern NBA, you have to hit threes to win games. And they've made that adjustment since the break. And he's coming off a huge performance, and his confidence couldn't be any higher. And his coach knows that, too. When it ain't broke, leave it alone. Until someone stops him, just let him roll. Here's Gordon. Embiid. Oh! Joel Embiid with the follow. Yeah, Embiid is getting everything he wants on the offensive side. He's playing some aggressive basketball right now. And we've reached the end of the third. The end of the third Sixers ahead. The they lead by five. Resulting. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next 76. on 2K Sports. 89. 
And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. You can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. And the ability to drop your jaw with the pass is something you rarely see in this league. What a talent he is. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. Jalen Brown is out there with Sviatoslav Mikhailu. Then there's Al Horford. Then there's Peyton Pritchard. And it's Hauser in at the two spot. That's the Boston Five. And Pritchard, here we go. Can't connect from short range. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. This is why he's out there in situations like this. He stands tall to prevent points. Boston trailing. Horford inside. Working on Covington. Fade away. And that one's long. The 76ers shooting about 41%. Pass to Lowry. Fires the three. Bowser grabs the board. Well, the Celtics shooting at 45% of the game so far. Oh, they get a hand on it. Stolen by Drummond. Just over a minute played here in the fourth. Lowry outside. Pass break. Here come the Celtics. Here's Pritchard. And he lays it in on the break. They found strong offensive footing in the open court. And they need to use that momentum, clawing their way back via fast break points. Gordon, the pass to Covington. Back to Gordon. We've made our way through just over a minute and a half of this fourth quarter. And the shot goes. It's winning time. And that's a winning play. Here's Hauser. Pass to Brown. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. First team foul. Love the aggression from Brown. A tough call for any defender out there. Jalen Brown. That free throw, no good. Good on the second one. Just a tough miss at the line. They're down two baskets now. And it's Lowry with the ball for the Philadelphia 76ers. They played a great fourth quarter defensively, allowing only three points. Now here's Lowry. A title-winning point guard. Kyle Lowry making the right choice there. Here's Pritchard. Down low. Bowser can't get it to go. The 76ers have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Shot is good by Gordon. Gordon. And now an 8-point 76ers lead. A nifty play off the dribble. Creates barely enough space to get off the shot. Richard. Some solid defense from Drummond. For Philadelphia, they've gone three of five since this fourth quarter started. Lowry, no good. The Celtics have gotten only one of five to fall here in the fourth. Mikhailu, pass to Brown. Oh, he finds himself wide open and drills it. Philadelphia shooting the ball at around 42% for the game. Lowry surveys the D. Pass to Gordon. Here's Hauser, defended by Gordon. Oh, Drummond with the block. And they'll keep possession. Pritchard, no good. Pritchard's gotten just four of his ten shots to fall here. And here's Gordon. Covington finds Gordon. 
Shoots over Brown. Gordon can't hit. The Celtics shooting around 44%. Not bad. Brown against Gordon. Pass to Hauser. To the wing, right side. Six to shoot. Here's Pritchard. And there's the rejection. And he gets it back. And that one's good. The Sixers leading. Lowry outside. Takes a three. The rebound, Celtics. Gotta find easier shots when you're already struggling. That's not gonna get it. Horford can't hit. Philadelphia's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Pass to Covington. And it's in there. Covington. A long, strong forward. Covington shows the ability to finish inside. Timeout time called. Time the Celtics. Time out. Coach really needs to get his guys fired up in attacking the glass. They're not putting up much of a fight, and it's led to way too many second chance shots. It's time for some t shirts. Make some noise, fans. So Boston's going with almost an entire new group here. Kristaps Porzingis, he's checked in for Horford. Jason Tatum comes in for Mikhailuk. White, he's checked in for Hauser. And Holiday subbed in for Pritchard. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. Over the break, I listened in on Joe Mazzula's huddle. And it was a frustrating oh, huddle. Coaches and players were angry about the turnovers. Players trying to hold each other accountable. They're fed up with sloppy play. Let's see how they respond. Guys. Appreciate the report, Allie. Pass to George. like it'll be Six Philadelphia ball. ball. Just five to shoot. Maxi finds Martin. Late clock. The Sixers need to pull one up here. It's good. Oh, George. George has got 19 points. This goes to 30 play from Taylor. George in the paint. Getting by the contact and to his finish. George against Tatum. Tatum knocks it down. He's locked in right now. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. And his team needs every bit of his production if they want to pull this one out. It is neck and neck here in the final period. No good on the shot. Good D by Porzingis. Austin Trailer. A deep three. Tries again. Philadelphia grabs the miss. Oubre's got his fourth rebound in this one. Martin. And they get it back. That's been the difference tonight. They've been insanely disruptive in the glass. George, another shot. There's another block. Swatty shots away by Ferocity. He is not messing around in this one. Tatum to the rack. And he lays it up and in. Tatum. He's got 21. The quicks of Tatum on display. Jason has a devastating first step, man. He can just blow by you so easy. Ubre passes to Maxi. Rebound Boston. Brown's got rebound number eight now. Pass to Holiday. Back to Brown. Shoots over George. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. Now here's Maxie. to George. Now Martin. Clock at six. Pass to Maxi. The three is up. Porzingis grabs the board. Porzingis has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. George with the block. 
Yeah, rejecting the try there. George firing up his guys. Tatum gets the bucket. Coming down the stretch. It's still anyone's game. Incredible effort and energy on both sides. These guys must be gassed. Embiid misses. Shocking that he just bricked that one. The defense got real lucky there. Holiday got it again. That makes him 8 for 15 for the night. A long, wiry combo guard. Holiday can make some acrobatic finishes. To win the drought. And it's Maxi missing. Showing great intensity around the rim. It's part of why he's a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. Now, we know he can hit threes. But Chris Stapp's showing he can slam it, too. Here's Oubre. Following the bucket by the Celtics. Yeah, they just can't seem to end the drought no matter where they shoot it from. This is snowballing for them. They've got to get a good look next time down. They grab their own miss. Outside Holiday. From downtown. And the Celtics have another three. From year to year, Holiday is a little inconsistent from three. But the defense has to respect his shot. Pass to George. Here's Oubre for three. Maxi knocks down the triples. Attacking in a big three open. Maxi is not holding back. And the Celtics call time here. And something fans don't always get to see. Some of the closely guarded secrets that happen in that huddle. And we see it so often. The 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 game game the everything Come falls everybody. into place Make for a team. Some noise. the New Balance player of the game, Jason Tatum. Yeah, he attacked the block all game and has been rewarded for it. The fundamentals that he displayed are why he got whatever he wanted out there on the floor. Hey, let's face it, the defense had no answer for him. Tatum. Back to White. Shot clock at five. And it's off from three-point range. He is just so deadly from out there. You expect that to fall. Pass to Embiid. The whistle on the way up, so he'll be headed to the line from right there. Christoph Porzingis picks one up. I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily prevented the points. Joel Embiid, two shots. The first one falls. Drops them both. He knows just how important these shots are, and he makes them count. Pass to Porzingis. Two Back minutes to White. remaining in the game. Two minutes. We've got 155 left in the game. And it's blocked by Embiid. Here's the break. The finish. And he caps off the break with a monster slam. Woo. His energy is unmatched. That man was just on the other end. And he gets it to go as they call the foul. He's on his way to the line for one more. Oh, my. Huge play from Przingis. A testament to the competitiveness that he plays with. Second team foul. At the line, Christoph Porzingis.
That free throw good from Porzingis. That's exactly what this team needs right now. Completing the end one. Philadelphia has gone just one of six from downtown in this final quarter. Outside Maxi. To the inside. Here's a deep. Again with the block. And that's nine blocks. Well, and you know he's going to be coming hard for that tenth one, too. Boston has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Wide against Maxi. Side Porzingis. Just five on the clock. And Embiid with the block. And it's Tatum missing. He did everything in his power to make that a hard shot. Excellent D avoided fouling and got in perfect position to alter that shot. Now here's Embiid. Over Tatum. them a shot at overtime. And Boston calls time here. The score is tied at 110. 24 seconds left to play in the fourth. Teacher. for a review of the last second buzzer beater. Boy, this game hangs in the balance of this review now. And you know, from what we are seeing here on the monitor, it looks like he was late getting it off. Jason Tatum out there with Kristaps Porzingis. And it's Holiday in at the point. Here's Tatum. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. 
Defensive foul, Joel Embiid. That is his fifth personal foul. First team foul. At the line, Jason Tatum. And that one falls for Tatum. The Sixers trailing. Pass to Martin. Back to Maxi. He takes it in. Oh, it's blocked by Porzingis. They recover it. Let's it go from deep. And Maxi, the bucket. Maxie. On the assist by Oubre. Maxi's got 19 points. The Celtics shooting 44%. A pretty decent clip. Holiday passes to Tatum. It's rebounded by George. George has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Here's Martin. And here's another one for the Taylor, Sixers. Martin. And when you look at the numbers over the last few years, it's clear that George has made a jump as a playmaker. Holiday against Oubre. Outside Holiday. Clock at six. Pass to Tatum. Fires for three. Austin again missing. The 76ers have gone two of three from the field as OT gets going. Tatum with a steal. A little over a minute and a half gone now in overtime. And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. Six the screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Look, guys get away with this all the time, but on this occasion, he got caught. Holiday against Maxi. Embiid from outside. Another three for Philadelphia. And no doubt the ball is going to go to Embiid there. Needing a bucket, and he gets it. Pass to Brown. About two minutes into OT now. It's been a good one. Here's White. And here's Porzingis. Embiid covers. Porzingis misses. Now Philadelphia with it. They've gone on an 8-0 run. Embiid passes to Martin. Now Embiid. He's covered by Holiday. Hangs. It's Embiid. Well, going to work Embiid. inside. You can really feel the momentum swinging in their direction. Yeah, but they can't relax. They've got to keep Celtics. building on this lead because it is not safe. Timeout called. The Celtics. We know you all want a t-shirt, everyone. Well, let me hear you get one. Just over two and a half minutes in OT in this exciting contest. Holiday from long range. Counted from distance. Holiday. Holiday's Holy. got 26 points. Stepping up. Big time basket from Drew. I mean, we've seen him excel in big moments before. But wow. Maxi, that's Maxie. good. Maxie. Terrific design and execution. Leading to an opportunity Two right at the rim. Oh, great with a steal. Two minutes. Pass break, Philadelphia. inside. Hounded by Tatum. Second chance effort. And it's Maxi missing. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. This is why right. he's out there. In situations like this, he stands tall to prevent points. And the basket by Holiday. And man, does Holiday hustle out there. I mean, he keeps plays going with his activity. Maxi against Holiday. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he'll sit the rest of this one out. Yeah, too bad he fouled out. But this team does have some depth at the position. Taking two shots. First free throw is good. And that puts him up five. And 
so he drops them both, and it's a six-point ball game. Taking full advantage of his opportunities at the line to extend their lead. And it's Tatum with the ball for Boston. It's Tatum working inside. The guy you want taking this shot. Tatum gets fired up and delivers. For Philadelphia, they've gone 5 of 8 here in OT. against Maxi. Ooh, it's stolen away. Here's Cornette on the wing holiday. There's Tatum with the three. And it's good. And that one brings him within one. Some players shrink when the pressure's on, but he lives for these moments. Inside, here's Embiid. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. And if you can't force the turnover on that play, then that's not a bad foul. Shooting for Philadelphia, Joel Embiid. The line for two. He drops the first one, and that'll put him up two. Creating any type of separation is huge right now. Here's Tatum. He connects! Oh, what a sensational bucket! That brings him within one! It'd be great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. Pulls up. No good off the glass. So it's Boston now. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Takes it inside, and it's blocked by Embiid. Holiday has the open look. Count it! Holiday! And the leadership of Holiday shining through. Philadelphia. Awesome to see him come up big like this. Philadelphia calls timeout. They trail by one. Boston There's 14 seconds left in the first overtime period. All right, guys, what's your take? It's always interesting to see what play a coach has saved for a situation like this. If they've got a surefire quick bucket play, uh, let's just say now's the time to use it. And the Celtics make their switch here. For the Celtics. And Philadelphia New has possession. It's a one-point game. Here's Embiid. It's in! And who else do you want in this situation? It's all Celtics. about Embiid, and he's ready to carry that load. And Boston calls time here. It's They're time behind by one. T-shirts. Five ticks left in OT. All right, guys, what's your take? Down one with just enough time for a couple passes and a shot. We'll see what they can do. And it's time to get up out of your seats and get down. Coming on to the floor for the Celtics. And so it's Boston with it. And it's Tatum missing. So it's the 76ers taking the W in a close one. The they escape with the W, even though they needed a few extra minutes to pull it off. And both teams gave their ball. And when it came down to overtime, it was about who had more determination. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Joel, in the past, you've certainly had your critics, and you have not run from them. What are you looking to prove out there? Oh, uh, just being dominant, so I want every time people hear my name, I want them to know that I'm a dominant player. Well, you do have the ability to dominate every single night. Good luck moving forward. <laughs>